Welcome to a video from the DigitalLifestyle.com. Win new Windows 10 build to look at. This is build 20215 for Windows Insiders on the dev channel. Just a couple of changes of this build. I'm out on the road with my Surface Go. So I just wanted to show you what those changes are. And the first one is Search now supports dark mode. So this is Search. And you see I'm in light mode here. So if I flick to dark mode. Which I know a lot of people are fans on. We switch to dark mode. And when we go to Search we don't get it all in white which was quite jarring before we now get it in we now get it in dark mode so that's nice to see that unfortunately is the only main change with this with this build the rest of the changes are sort of fixes they fixed the issues with the security app would hang they fixed the issues with the uh, security app crashing um where there's a lot of exclusions they fixed an issue with a uh, restore point that had been created part prior to the Microsoft Edge update um, and it couldn't if you restored after that it couldn't uh, get Edge working they fixed the issue of the text cursor in Korean IME they fixed some typing issues and they fixed an issue where uh, the start menu didn't reflect an update that was pending restart so um, if you had a pending restart and the little icon there would show you uh, that wasn't working correctly so that was the fixes there's a few known issues. They're looking at um, still looking at issues of, uh, of Windows um, hanging during the installation period. Uh, I haven't seen that for a while. Uh, they still some issues with pinning tabs. Um, they're still they investigating issues with Office applications crashing after a, a new build, and they're uh, investigating some issues with the managed disk would crash. And it still does that on my Surface Go as well. So if you wanted to have a look at the disk volumes through settings you can't do that you need to use the old way of doing it uh, they're working on some issues with Linux kernels not being installed correctly from WSL dash install um, and they're investigating issues with uh, via Ethernet adapter with a Linux subsystem there's a couple of Linux subsystem issues actually and they're working on a fix for seeing generic errors when doing WSL install so really most of the issues are around the WSL so the only changes are the uh, dark mode in the start in the search and uh, I said no issues installing this build if it's working fine on me but that's it so that's my quick look at this build uh, 20215 more on our YouTube channel YouTube channel and more on the dishlifestyle.com